Welcome to Music Mondays, time of devotion, uh, sharing it from Christ in our home and our partners in ministry at Augsburg Fortress. Uh, today, here as we continue on our journey together, we'll share a devotion uh, uh, called, uh, well, titled with the title of the feast day for today, Matthias the Apostle Transfer. I think it was from yesterday, actually. Um, and so we're going to hear a little bit about uh, Matthias from the Gospel of Luke. So Luke 6 is where I will meet you if you'd like to read together here for a little bit. I'll meet you in um, verse 12 of chapter 6. Um, so won't you hear, read along as Jesus chooses some of his apostles here. Now during those days, Jesus went out to the mountain to pray, and he spent the night in prayer to God. And when day came, he called his disciples and chose twelve of them, whom he also named apostles, Simon, whom he named Peter, and his brother Andrew, and James, and John, and Philip, and Bartholomew, and Matthew, and Thomas, and James, son of Alphaeus, and Simon, who was called the Zealot, and Judas, son of James, and Judas Iscariot, who became a traitor. Jesus called his disciples and chose twelve of them, whom he also named apostles. Our focus is in are uh, invited to go here to that verse 13. Um, and let's share this devotion here together. Countless books and congregational programs offer advice for a discipleship program or for growing a church. Some may be on your shelves or in your pastor's office or your church library, but without dropping $12.99 or more at our favorite bookstore, we find in these verses from Luke, free of charge, the most basic steps. Pray, choose, send. <laughs> Pray, choose, send. I like that. That's what Jesus does as he establishes his church. What a clear reminder to not miss that first step. Pray for wisdom and insight about future decisions, include, including who to choose, who to ask. It certainly works for Jesus, who, like us, deals with both the finest and frailest of human beings. Consider Peter, who would betray him, who, I'm sorry, who would deny him, uh, and Judas, who would betray him and be replaced by Matthias. We may also serve Jesus in particular roles due to someone's prayerful decision making. Like the twelve disciples, Matthias, and many others, we are called, taught, nurtured, and sent, empowered by the Holy Spirit, to work uh, for the work ahead. Let's pray together here. Thank you, gracious God, for calling me to be a part of this always changing church. In Jesus' name, amen. And Mary, Jonah, Susan, etc., chosen and sent as well. Pastor Heike, yes. Thanks be to God for those women along the journey, uh, apostles fully and well. Uh, be invited as this day unfolds before you to continue in prayer for the church and for ELCA World Hunger Ministries, uh, which Pastor Heike uh, uh, co coincidentally uh, worked deeply and well for there as well. Um, so God continue to hold you. Yes, uh, all gathered here, Karen, me, Gail, Nancy, uh, and all of those that will engage with us throughout the day on our social media. Uh, may God bless you as you continue to bear God's word, the good news of Christ's love with you on the journey. We we'll look forward to sharing this week with you. God bless you.